What's up YouTube, Winterguard here. Today we're going to take the first official look at the Javazon uh, that I said I was bringing up. Uh, you might have seen the little teaser that I showed a couple days ago. Uh, and I've been running some cows and as you can tell by the title, uh, we're going to... Well, my original plan was just to do 100 runs, but um, we got a high rune fairly quickly. So I thought I'd go ahead and put this up and do then do like an official hundred runs. I, whatever. I'm not. I'm not actually sure yet. Uh, I was thinking a thousand, but even with the additional speed of running with the jabs on and cows, it's still probably going to take a pretty long time to do a thousand runs with the jabs on. So uh, that's still kind of up in the air. But um, we're going to go ahead and take a look at the character. And then we're going to get into uh, the runs I did. Um, go ahead and uh, comment that uh, how many runs you thought it took me to do or to get my first high rune. Uh, obviously, it was under 100 uh, because my original plan was to do 100 runs, and I stopped to go ahead and put this video out. So uh, give me a guess uh, what high rune and how many runs it took to get it. Uh, and we're going to go ahead and look at the character now and show you my setup. Alright, um, I don't have eth uh, Ethereal Titans, but I do have some 195s that I had kind of banked up. So we're using these right now. Um, I went with a more of a magic find setup, so this is not going to be your true um, kill speed Javazon. Even though, uh, if you look here, I do have my... Uh, Lightning Fury up to uh, level 40, so I mean it, it smacks pretty hard, but it's not really a kill speed build as you can see. I'm running Shaco, uh, not P Topaz yet. Um, also running a Scolders for Magic Find as well, there, uh, not socketed. I got Mars for the skills, uh, a Spirit uh, Monarch. This is a 33. I'm not swapping care, uh, items off of my. Uh, sorceress. Uh, these are all separate. Uh, my Sorceress has a 35. I just had this one just stashed away. I had made it a while back, so I, it was enough. Uh, I was mainly using it for the plus skills. <clears throat> and now, I, the, I found these on my Sorceress as well. These are Ethereal uh, Sandstorm Treks. Uh, they're really nice set of boots. Uh, I, I think I might switch these out, though. Uh, the 20% fun uh faster run walk is a little slow for me. I prefer 30 at least, so I might switch these out. There's not really a whole lot of gain from this uh, outside of cool factor. Uh, I said just running cows. This is not affecting anything either way, so I'll probably switch these out at some point. <clears throat> uh, pair of 39 chances. And then two Nagel rings. Now, uh, from the teaser, this ring is the one that I didn't ID in the teaser video. I actually found a 30 uh, Nagel ring just uh, messing around with it. That was like my second or th first or second uh, cow run just to see how it ran. Uh, and as you can see, <laughs> that was a pretty neat pickup. And I'm running T Gods for more damage. Uh, I don't need the Lightning Absorb. Well, I mean, there's a little bit when you're messing with the Cow King, but um, Lightning's not that big of an issue, but it does have the plus three Lightning Fury uh, and the uh, Absorb. So I, I went with these just, just to mess around with them. Um, and that's it. For, well, let's look at the charms. <clears throat> so I have uh, a 36 Geeds, and then I had already stashed away three Jab Charms, one with Life kind of nice the other two are plain uh just a random magic find uh grand charm and then just random smalls these i'll have to build up uh as i as i run cows and then i have this this torch this was actually the first torch i had got um before i got my sork torch so this i this one i got from uh running for keys and then having one of the guys in Discord uh, do the Ubers for me. I actually got the uh, Zon Torch first. Um, on my Mercenary, <clears throat> running Tau Mask. I think he's almost, I think he needs another level for an Andes, which I got several of. Uh, got a, just an Archon Treachery on it. It's not uh, 
ethereal so it's I'll probably replace this at some point and then I got a uh, just a uh, non-ethereal uh, inside thresher this one's pretty decent but uh, I've had quite the time not finding ethereal bases so at some point we're gonna want to replace this with the infinity which is what I'm building up to uh, so this is kind of the reason for making this character I'm gonna run cows for runes uh, item wise I pretty much got just about everything I need so we're needing runes at this point to kind of finish some things out um, as far as magic find based off of that setup it's actually at 303 which kind of kind of high for a Zon to be honest but uh, it could actually go a little higher if I were to uh, P Topaz both of these pieces. We could even be up there a little more. So it's kind of a weird setup, but it works for cows. Uh, resists are, they got negative fire, but that's not, that, none of this stuff comes into play with cows. Cows, you just want to kill stuff. As long as your kill speed's okay, then, you know, the magic find gear works. Uh, and I have some points stashed. I'm not sure what I'm holding it out for. I got enough strength for. The monarch, so I don't think there's anything else really that I need to stash these points for. So honestly, I'll just go ahead and dump these here while I'm thinking about it. Um, I don't need max block. I'm not in uh, melee range that much. I do use uh, charge strike a little bit to finish off individual mobs. I, and I think the problem with what I'm doing, uh, I have a bad habit of trying to kill everything. And I think with the... the Javazon, you want to just get large packs, burn them down, and move to the next large pack. I have a tendency to slow myself down, killing individual mobs. So that probably is slowing me down as far as my overall times in cows. Uh, the large packs do go down pretty quick. And you'll see in these uh, uh, couple of runs that I do that uh, uh, she does fine. But then I'd run off and try and pick off individual cows. I probably just should just keep on trucking. But anyways, neither here nor there. We're going to get into the runs. Uh, I got a couple runs that I found some stuff before I found the high rune. Again, uh, give a guess on what high rune I found and what uh, how many runs it took me. Uh, and leave it in the comments. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and get into this. If you enjoy the video, give me a like and subscribe. I will be trying to set up my stream here shortly. So be looking out for that and uh, join our discord links in the description we'll go ahead and get into this okay we're into run 25 here and we're scrambling a little bit uh, I don't remember what I gained a lot of levels in cows um, the bosses are still giving me a little bit of a hard time but as you can see that one drops a pull room uh, cow king is real pain uh, finally high enough to where my merc can kill him if he's not phys, phys immune but uh, this was, I think I was like around 76 right now. So we're, we're still chugging, but uh, things are a little slower. It gets a lot faster later on. Okay, we're in the run 31 here, and I had just leveled uh, and ran into this champ pack. So I was going to finish them off before uh, uh, dealing with the points. And I get uh, the Spired Helm to drop, which is pretty cool. Uh, again, Magic Find is pretty decent, so I'm not surprised that I'm getting some drops. Uh, this is actually my first Veil. Um, it's a decent helm. Nightwings is probably better, but um, it was uh, it, I haven't gotten either one, so that was that was kind of uh, a, a unique that I haven't gotten yet. So I figured I'd show it. Okay, this is run 38, and for those that guessed around this, this is the High Rune drop. Uh, but this also kind of highlights the issues with uh, a Javazon. So, the, what I'm meaning by that, you're going to get a lot of kills off screen. So there's a chance of missing stuff. So you see, it's way up there. It, it dropped off screen. It was off screen kill. So, um, I mean, if you're diligent, of course, you, you'll see that stuff. But there, there's going to be a time where you're going to kill stuff pretty off screen or off screen in good ways, and you might not actually s see the drops. So you got to be aware of that when playing a Javazon. You're going to get a lot of off screen kills, so make sure to check everything. But again, run 38, and we get a Sur rune, so that's half a burr, which is what we're looking for. Okay, just as a recap, as you guys saw, we got a Sur rune on run 38, which actually is 
pretty quick. Um, honestly, wasn't expecting one that soon. Uh, so if you t see here, <clears throat> that's actually my second one. I got I found one on my source a while back. So I got my first Burr rune, which is what we're shooting for to eventually build the Infinity. Uh, and I also need one. I want to build uh, an Enigma for later use, either on this character or maybe build up a Pally next. Uh, or Necro. I mean, I could use that on multiple different tunes. So, we got our first Burr. I need a second one for the Infinity. What is it? Burr, Mal, Burr, Ist? So I got everything else. So, I just need a, a second Burr rune. Maybe we'll get one to drop in cows. We'll see. Um, so, I'm going to do some more cow runs after this uh, and uh, see what we come up with. Uh, so be looking out for video on that. Uh, as a side note, I've been doing, I got a lot of stuff going on. Uh, I'm going to be dropping an actual Warzone video with the new Vanguard uh, Warzone that dropped uh, about a week ago now. A little over a week. Uh, the guys I run with, uh, we got our first win. Um, honestly, it was kind of funny how it went down. Yeah, and I might have mentioned it before, it's but just a bunch of old guys playing, so we are definitely not the typical Warzone group. But we do pretty well, so I'm going to probably drop a video on that, just kind of mix things up a little bit. Um, I noticed this morning that there was a patch uh, where Blizzard fixed a couple of bugs. Uh, nothing really worth noting. Uh, I haven't ran into the issues, it was some force move stuff. Uh, key binding and some uh, fast cast uh, changes or adjustments uh, they had some bugs with that stuff uh, so not really worth mentioning so if you want to uh, look into that I think you can link to the patch notes from the launcher or find it in the blizzard forums so I'm not going to really get into the uh, patch that occurred this morning um, so we'll leave it at that be looking out for my next uh, Javazon video uh, is, I'll probably still be running cows for a little bit um, trying to track down that second burrow rune and see if we can build an infinity uh, then uh, not sure which way we'll go from there but uh, if you guys got any suggestions let me know uh, I'm still I'm actually working on a necromancer as well um, I had mentioned that in previous video so I went with the Javazon because that was pretty quick to get into cows to get the runes I needed um, the Necromancer, I've, I've already gotten through Norm Rush, um, and I'll probably get that set up to run through uh, Nightmare in Hell. Uh, I'm not sure which build to use, though. I originally started to go with a Bone Necro. Uh, a lot of people are saying to play Summoner, so we'll see. I mean, there's a, there's a lot of options with that, and I'm probably going to switch up this Amazon to a couple different builds as well at some point. Uh, I've always liked playing a Boazon, but I wanted the Jab for cows um, so I might play around with a couple of uh, bulls on builds as well uh, so be looking out for that so we got a lot of options or a lot of videos coming up here shortly uh, a couple of different build videos for for the Amazon and the necro coming up and also have plans for paladin as well but it's not going to be your regular hammered in or zealer or smiter I've, I had wanted to make a uh, Fist of Heavens Pally, a faux Pally. So that's probably going to be on the horizon. So uh, a lot of things in the works. So be looking out for that. Again, uh, if you enjoyed the video, give me a like and subscribe. Uh, links to our Discord is in the description. We've got a lot of active people there. Uh, continually growing. So uh, join us there. But uh, we'll leave it here for now. You guys have a great day. Keep on farming.